The glaciers of Georgia are mainly located along the Greater Caucasus mountain range. Topic: <laughs> Geography. The spatial distribution of contemporary glaciers in the territory of Georgia is stipulated by the peculiarities of atmospheric processes, morphological morphometric conditions of the relief and their interaction. Main centers of glaciation are related to the elevated Greater Caucasus Watershed Range and Kazbegi Massif. Individual centers can be found in the Greater Caucasus Branch Ranges, Bizipi, Kodori, Samagrelo, Svaneti, Lechkami, Pirakita, etc. According to the data of 2015 there are 637 glaciers in Georgia with a total area of 355.80 square kilometers. Contemporary glaciers are mainly concentrated in the Angori, Rioni, Kodori and Turji River basins, where there are the peaks of 4,500 meters and higher. 89.32% of the amount and 97.15% of the area of glaciers of Georgia are located in these basins. Contemporary glaciers are unevenly distributed between the different river basins. Here the leading place belongs to the Angori River Basin, 42.22% of the total number of the glaciers of Georgia is the share of it, as well as 62.78% of the total area of the glaciers of Georgia is a share of the Angori River Basin. Except the Angori River Basin the shares of the other river basins in the total number of the glaciers of Georgia are distributed as follows, the Kodori River Basin 22.76%, the Rioni River Basin 15.22%, the Turji River Basin 9.10%, the Pirakita Alazani River Basin 3.19%, the Bizipi River Basin 2.82%, the Liakvi River Basin 1.56% and the Kobaskali River Basin 1.41%. 1%. As for the basins of the rivers of Arguni, Asa, Erigva and Kelisori, their joint share is 1.72% of the total number of the glaciers of Georgia. Except the Angori River Basin the shares of the other river basins in the total area of the glaciers of Georgia are distributed as follows, the Rioni River Basin 13.11%, the Kodori River Basin 11.25%, the Turji River Basin 9.99%, the Bizipi River Basin 1.12%, the Pirakita Alazani River Basin 0.68%. As for the basins of the rivers of Liakvi, Asa, Kobaskali, Arguni, Erigva and Kelisori, their joint share is 1.07% of the total area of the glaciers of Georgia. <inaudible> Overview Western Georgia features a fairly well-developed glacial system, with numerous glaciers occurring from the source of the Bzyb River in western Abkhazia to the Mamison Pass on the border with North Ossetia. The nation's largest glaciers lie in the Ingori River basin of this region. Eastern Georgia's glaciers generally occur in smaller, isolated groups. In addition, the mountain ranges that rise to the north of the Greater Caucasus mountain range are more glaciated than the adjacent ranges that branch out from the southern slopes of the Caucasus. The line of glaciation ranges between 2,800 to 2,900 meters above sea level in western Georgia to 3,600 meters in extreme eastern Georgia, near Lagodeki. The contrast occurs mainly due to differences in climate caused by a general west-east reduction in precipitation, which results in a more continental climate in parts of eastern Georgia. <laughs> List of glaciers Notable glaciers in Georgia include Abano Glacier Adishi Glacier Devdaraki Dolra Gurgeti Lexiri Glacier Saneri Glacier Tviberi Glacier Topic History of Research Great Georgian scientist Vakushti Bagrationi gives the first scientific information on the glaciers of Georgia in the beginning of the 18th century there are big mountains, which have the Caucasus to the north from the Black Sea to the Caspian Sea, the height of which is of one day walking and the highest of it is permanently frosty, the length of the ice is of KL arm, and in summer it breaks and, if a man stays there, he cannot endure the cold even for a little time, and under it the rivers flow, and the ice is green and red, as a rock due to its age. 
After almost hundred years the foreign scientists began to describe the glaciers of Georgia. Information about the glaciers of Georgia can be found in the works of von Abich 1865, Gustav Rad 1873, N. Dinnick 1884, I. Ryszewski 1904, etc. This information is related to the individual glaciers and mostly is of descriptive nature. However, their findings greatly assist us in determining the dynamics of the individual glaciers. In the years of 1880–1910 the topographical surveying of the Greater Caucasus was carried out. On the basis of the created maps K. I. Podizersky compiled the first detailed catalogue of the glaciers, which still has not lost its importance, but it must be mentioned, that the errors were made during its compilation. A. L. Reinhardt noted these errors further, who compiled the new catalogue for many glacial basins of the investigated region and defined the location of the snowline. The research conducted by A. Reinhardt is of high quality and more reliable by its scientific value in comparison with its previous researchers. Interesting researches were conducted by F. Rutkovskaya in connection with the second international polar year. In 1932–1933 the glaciations of the Angori River was studied and the dynamics in the one -year period of the individual glaciers were identified. In 1959 P. A. Ivankov gave us the total number and area of glaciers of the study area based on the new topographic maps and the arrow images of 1946. In the same year P. Kovalev described in details the glaciers and carried out their labeling. Much work has been conducted by D. Saratelli for the study of the glaciers of Georgia, who in 1937 together with Al. Aslanikashvili surveyed several glaciers and in 1963 gave us the dynamics of the glaciers during the period of 1937–1960. Particularly should be mentioned the great and versatile work, which was done by the Glaciological Laboratory of Vikushti Bagrationi Institute of Geography, the multiannual work of which is summarized in the 1975 year's edition of the Catalogue of Glaciers, as well as by the Hydrographical Division of the Hydro-Meteorological Department, which published the work about the glaciers of the Greater Caucasus editors, V. Somaya and E. Drobyshev, 1970. It should be also noted the many years' research of various glaciers in the major river basins by R. Gobejashvili. It can be considered his honor that after the 1990s the glaciological studies have not been stopped in Georgia. L. Marashvili, D. Ukleba. T. Kikalishvili, G. Kurjhelidze, D. Tabidze, R. Kazaradze, O. Nikolashvili, V. Somaya, O. Drobashevi, R. Shengelia, R. Gobejashvili, K. Emgaladze, T. Lashki, Shish. Anashvili, N. Golodovskaya, L. Serebriani, A. Orlov, O. Nadirashvili, N. Zakharashvili, A. Rekviashvili, O. Samadbegishvili and others studied the glaciers of Georgia according to the river basins. Glacial geomorphological works were being carried out from 1968 R. The largest glaciers of the different river basins were surveyed by the phototheodolite method, such as, Zofito La Boda, Curtisho, Brili, Chasiktomi, Adina, Kavargula, Boko, Bubba, T. Bilisa, Adishi, Chalati, Dolra, K. V. Ishi, Latavali, Shikara, Namkavani, Korodashi, Maruki, Klichi and the Cirque-type glaciers of the Klichi Basin. Today in Georgia the Vikushti Bagrationi Institute of Geography is the only institution, which scientifically researches the Caucasus glaciers. Glaciological Group, by the leadership of Levan Tielidze, every year conducts glaciological expeditions to the Caucasus glaciers in the different river basins. See also Glaciology